Ben and Chrissy at Caravan Cararis, and welcome back to a exciting video for Benjamin. The car's going back together. Yes. Slowly yes. but surely, she's getting there. How long have we got? About three weeks to get this sorted? We have. We've got freshly painted parts to go on the baby S2000. So, wings over fenders going on. Excited. And rubber. It's all there, like, ready to go. Rubber. Oh, yeah, I've got the front tyres as front well. Front tyres as well. As so long last. Going on today. So, we're freshly painted up. Thanks to Craig at Torbay Craig King Car at Hospital. Torbay Car Hospital. Cheers, Craig. Thank Shout out to you, she mate. did them in quick time. Uh, just bear in mind, obviously, when you watch it and we fitted them and that, that I'm probably going to do it in the winter because I just want to drive the car. It will then be getting all blended and stuff afterwards to properly, properly match it all in, blah, 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 blah. So at the minute, I just need to drive it and have it ready for shows and stuff. Yeah. You know what I mean? So yeah, super happy, mate. But Very excited. It's still going to be not. Oh, um, I've got the number plate on as well. Still not going to be quite ready anyway because you've got to get your alignment done and we've got to. Yeah, which I've spoken to the, the chaps about stuff. and uh, they're going to sort the alignment out for me. We're going to have to lower it slightly, blah, blah, blah. So once these are on, it's just setting up an alignment and yeah. then it's drivable. So that's that's the main thing. But you could always drive it now, Benj. Have a look at the front guys here. Come to oh, that's terrible. Well, I, I spent a couple hours very tentatively loosening no, the front that's... camber bolts. How retro is that? Isn't it? It looks like a bug. <laughs> so as you can see, the front passenger is kicking out Yeah, Ben's quite a been bit. playing with his camber bolts. I had to loosen them yeah. because I was worried that they were going to be stuck and it's an absolute well, I don't think we would have been able to do it get them out and replace them no. and they're not bloody cheap either but they're loose and they do adjust and it moves the wheel in and out and it front, should just be enough front are loose we haven't tackled the wheels no we yet. haven't tackled the rears I'm hoping they won't have to really touch that though for the for the alignment yeah because to be fair the camber sits perfect as it, it does. is it does yeah it really does and when it's lowered it will tuck them up even more so the front so, yeah. is the, the, uh, the issue that's it we've well, seen us take all the wings off you don't really need to see us bolt them all back on again Benjamin busting his ass off on all uh, this, mate. He's done all this. All, nice. the, all the wheel ups are done now. This one's done. I've, I've also put a bit more seam seal over there because where Mark welded it, there was a few tiny little holes. So I thought, rather than risk water well. coming in, if water gets inside there, then you're yeah, totally, mate. You might fudged. Do, it. You might do well you know do what I mean? Just in case, same on this side. I did this the other day, so it's all it's all ready for stone chipping, really, which I'll do at a later date when I've got the stuff because I haven't got it at the moment. But I did see Halford sell it. I just want to get the spray can jobby for now. Because you can get the actual gun that goes onto the airline. You can, but I'm not going to bother, mate. It's 10 quid for a spray can. I'm only doing the rears because there's not really anything to do on the front. Yeah, I'm true. Well, apart. your arch liner and that, anyway, aren't you? Mm, well, I probably won't put that back in, to be fair. You, know, you, got off you can't really put it in. Like there's nothing to fix it to. Uh, of course, yeah. yeah. But I might be able to just maybe put a bit in the front here. I'll have a look. I might be able to just put something in here. Maybe. But, well, look at that. I wouldn't worry about it because this, car's, this car's only going to come out in dry conditions anyway, really. Isn't it? It so. is. That's very true. So, uh, right, first let's get bolt one on. Get it bolted on. Put up the rear first, sure. If you want, mate. I reckon. Do the rear first. I'll time lapse this bit and then we'll come back to you. Okay.
Right then, we didn't film a lot of that. Obviously, you saw the time lapse of us bolting stuff on, didn't they, Chrissy? Yes, but, they did. Um, yeah. It's I was sweating a bit, not going to lie, because of the <clears> fresh <throat> paint and scratching and stuff like that. He was but... very stressed. I think he had about five cigarettes while doing it. It's very stressy, but, but he's happy honest to God, result. I was just stood here saying to you when I, I was like, I can't actually believe, and we did just have the Jays Racing front end on as well. We're not going to show you that yet. But um, I've just noticed something that's going to bug the shit out of as well. What? Inside that wheel. What? Oh, a sticker. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I can get them off. I thought it was something fucking serious. No, nothing serious. Although, one of his wings has already been christened. Oh, yeah. Fucking Gerald, the fucking swallow, shat all over it. We've got our residents. We've got Gerald and Geraldine in here. And, yeah, most fucking Gerald. shit. We, I fucking had a right go at him. I tell you. But anyway, I was just stood here when I was saying to you that I... I, I, got a little, I, I don't know what it is with cars, but anyone that's a car person will get it. But yeah. everyone has a dream car. And it was my dream car. And I'm building my dream car. And I kind of stood there a little bit like lost for words. When we put the front bumper on, the Jay's bumper, I was like, mate, I cannot believe that this is actually my car. You've been very quiet. I must admit, he's been very quiet. I have, because it's, it's hard. I've had this vision in my head. You know what I'm like? Yeah. yeah. And I'm trying to make it a reality. And it is so close now. And the paint match is amazing. Well, we just need to show you now, don't we? So I think it's time for Ben to cue it. Cue cinematic. think i am so happy mate so happy to obviously better. bear in mind that it's filthy dirty and on camera it actually looks like the panels are a really different color but i'm super happy with the paint match i don't need to get it blended immediately because it's that good mm. the car is bloody filthy i cannot wait to get some of our clean products yeah mate uh, obviously suspension needs sorting it needs to be lowered <clears throat> uh the camera needs sorting on the fronts not a lot which is good Obviously the front bumper, the indicators need sticking in, there's still bits and bobs to do, but you get the idea. Now, I am fucking over the moon. Yeah. Like, I literally am. I'm going to go home tonight and be Happy. like... <sighs> do you know what I mean? Especially on the ground and not on axle stands. I know, mate. It's fucking mad. Obviously there's no front end on it. Well, there was, and oh my God. Yeah, yeah. Didn't it look oh, good? Gerald's back. Oh, Gerald. Yeah, there he is. Fucking shitting on my car, you little c <gasps> I'll beat that out. Not that's it. There he is, that, sat up there on the Red Bull. There's two of them there, nesting. But yeah. I'm super pleased. And the wheels, oh my god. So glad I went with the wheels. Just perfect. Oh, and the wheel nuts look amazing against the grey. It's just all coming together, mate. It's just amazing. Just amazing. Like, just made up, mate. I hope you all agree. That's incredible. It's, it, a lot of time and effort's gone into this, isn't it? And for those of you oh, that both of our hopefully come into. BHP, which is in yeah, you can come and see, it. see both of them. The car will be there because she will be done. She will be. Well, all, all we got to do, I think, we were going to put the bumper on and all that, but I think we'll do that next weekend. Spend a bit of time titivating. Yeah. Stick the indicators in because all the clips have broke. Put the front bumper on, lower it, and then I'll try and book it in the week after for the wheel alignment. Well, I will book it in for the wheel alignment, and then we're ready for the show. We fucking did it, mate. He's so happy. Oh, well, so I happy. am. We've got. We would have had a week to spare. Yeah. We would really have. We really, really would have. But oh, so many people to thank. But I'm going to leave that until 
we've watched it and it's done the final sat out in the, the sun. final video of it I'm going to thank every single person that's contributed towards it in any way shape or form so but yeah. let's face it guys right I know Ben very well you guys know Ben a little bit obviously um, this car's never going to be finished because he'll always be doing something <laughs> to it he'll always be adding something else there's to so it there's so much left to do my list is yeah. vast I mean the rear end needs loads doing to it there's carbon bits that are going to go everywhere there's side skirts the engine bay and then once all that's done then we'll be looking basically at a few more thousand pounds looking at power yeah <sighs> there we go I'm like oh dear me I don't know what to say but thanks everyone for watching <laughs> <laughs> I'm, like, I'm a bit goofy I feel a bit drunk exciting bits coming up for the FN as well oh very exciting um, thank you to Danny, Danny uh, Dino Dino Days hooked sponsor. me up again because he's an absolute wow he's just a beautiful man yeah Chris is going power now because obviously the exterior is pretty much done pretty much done yeah so uh, Chris is all about the big breathing mods all and about. stuff like that and yeah. all that in it very exciting and then we can actually get up there and see him yes and we've got two drivable cars well you need two more things on yours and then we'll be going up there yeah I mean you've got one of them I've got one of them and then you've pretty much got the other one really when you think about it financially yeah yeah but I need, to, I need to sell something in order to get that but yeah exciting times amazing so thank you all thank you to Danny as always for sponsoring the channel you're an absolute diamond oh also just quickly oh. just to say uh, Danny uh, when we do come up to get the cars mapped might suggest that you get a set of earplugs because <laughs> when this thing goes on the dyno trust me I think you're going to need it because it's I've got so some loud I've got some pink fluffy ones that Rob gave me you haven't you yeah it's so loud but it sounds amazing it's so ridiculously loud but now the noise suits the car it does before I was tooting along on a stock S2K and it was <laughs> yeah. like oh what's this oh. stock wheels stock so MX5 <gasps> that's, what, that's what people say all the time I get ripped for that a well, friend, anyone of, friend of ours at work says that to Ben all the time when he's working Dick, at, yeah, you piss working off at our yard for scythe. anyway yeah. thank you to the usuals Toxic Dobbs Tactical Racing obviously Dino Days for sponsoring the channel Carbon My Ride Carbon My Ride Legends. discount codes all at the end of the video we love you all and we shall see you on the, the next, next video. video peace, peace out bye